This video is about finding core asteroids in rocky ring systems. So you may be looking for muscovite, you may be looking for monazite or other such things, very valuable resources to sell, you can make a lot of credits from them. So this video will hopefully show you the difference between what's actually a core asteroid and something that looks very similar to a core asteroid but might potentially catch you out. So the core asteroids have a very bright yellow colour in rocky systems, whereas the ones that might fool you still have a very intense colour but they have a slightly golden luster to them. Those ones aren't and might just fool you if you're not used to it. If it has a yellow colour but it's kind of a bit fainter and you can still see the rocky surface of the asteroid then you definitely know that's not going to be a core asteroid and it's going to probably just have surface deposits or subsurface deposits. So I'm going to show you an example of each in a second. Evil asteroid. Notice the gold luster. It's not a core asteroid. You can also notice, if you get close to you can notice the fissures on the asteroid. You can actually see them. But a core asteroid and rocky rings should be a very bright yellow and shouldn't have the slightly darker golden luster that you're used to seeing in the icy rings, to the best of my recollection. Now, notice how the whole thing lights up very bright yellow. There's very little gold that's very, very bright yellow. This is a core asteroid. Alexandrite, not quite what I was looking for, given that I'm in a Muscovite hotspot, but it's still a valuable resource, so it will do. A lot of the other asteroids will glow yellow, but you'll be able to see it, it's kind of opaque and you can still see the rock surface that's definitely not going to be a core asteroid but those ones that have a very dense color but they're a darker gold color um, are also well I call them evil ones because they're the ones that can fool you into thinking it's a core asteroid when they're not I hope this helps for videos on how to use the seismic charge launcher to crack open your core asteroid once you've found it and then to use the abrasion blaster to free up more resource chunks from the surface of the broken asteroid once it's been cracked. If you refer to my channel on YouTube, which is Commander Giles Farnaby, and look for Muscovite Mining Deep Core. So that's my channel, which is Commander Giles Farnaby, and I wish you happy mining, everyone.